I saw the Commission's proposal regarding the price caps on gas and the joint purchases of gas, and if these measures are indeed implemented, that would indeed mean a considerable step forward in our response to the crisis triggered by Putin. Once again, we see that member states are slowly beginning to understand that individualism doesn't really work in a crisis situation, and it is important to show solidarity. This solidarity cannot be dictated by regulations. We need to feel it. We need to learn uh, how to do it, and we need to apply it henceforth whenever confronted with uh, such uh, such uh, situations. And we have to look beyond the EU. We need to think of our neighbours. Our solidarity has to be demonstrated not only in relation to the Ukraine, but also when it comes to the Republic of Moldova and the Balkans. Not just because we have a bond with these regions and countries, but because we don't want crisis there as well. And let's also think about the gas used by certain industrial sectors. I'm thinking about the, the, the production of fertilizers. For the short term, at least, we must not allow the gas crisis to create a new food crisis. Thank you. Thank you. The next speaker is Mr. Zahra